Yo, what's up traders? Welcome to my trading platform. Dun, 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 dun. Theme music, theme music, theme music. Guys, I'm so excited. I want to show you guys a very, very powerful strategy that you can use right now to trade uh, the US 30, okay? A very, very powerful strategy. But anyway, before I get into all that, uh, guys, if you don't know, um, if you don't already know, my name is uh, uh, Matt Trades. You know, I'm on Instagram, Telegram, and YouTube. This is my YouTube platform. Uh, thank you guys for making it over here. Okay, so then I'm going to be doing a three day series. This is day one of the US 30 trading series. Uh, how powerful is that? So I'm going to be showing you guys how to use this strategy on a five minute chart to trade the US 30. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm, okay, I'm so excited, guys. I'm super, super excited. Okay. So, anyways, like I said, we're going to be trading on the five minute chart. Okay. We're going to be using um, this strategy to trade the five minute chart. But before uh, we, we, we get on to that, there's some things that you need to know. All right. So, yeah, let's just get the background first before we actually jump into the trading setup. Okay. So, there's like, like two things that you need to know. All right, so I'm just going to open it up over here. Uh, there's two trading conditions that need to be present, all right, that need to be visible, okay, in order for you to actually take this trade, okay. So there's two of them, right. Number one is you either need to see a trend line breakout, all right, in order for you to take a trade. Or number two, there needs to be a trading range, all right. I'm going to show you what I mean in just a bit, all right. Okay, so like you guys know, um, a trend line is basically when you join two points, um, two low points or two high points. Okay, you join them with a line and then you get a trend line. So then now when you see the price break a trend line, okay, that's a potential trade for you if you're using this strategy, okay, that I'm going to be showing you guys in just a bit, all right? Same thing, like if you take two tops and then you join them with a the trend line, okay, and then the price breaks out there and it, it escapes the trend line. Okay, that's a potential move. All right, so I just need you guys to catch that. It's nothing complicated. It's just that you need to know this. Okay, it's very vital for you to catch the right trades. Okay. Anyways, again, here's another example. You got two points. All right, then you got a line connecting with the line, and then the price breaks out of that trend line. Okay, and then that's a potential trade. So that's the first kind of. A condition or trading condition or market condition that needs to be present in order for you to actually open up a trade. Okay, number one. So I'll show you on the chart in just a bit. Don't worry. I know some of you guys are panicking. I don't know why you panic. Okay, but you know, just don't panic. Relax and make some money. This makes some money. We, this is a money video, guys. This is a money video. If you catch what I'm saying today, you are gonna kill these markets. Anyways, let's go on. Now this is an example. Of the second trading um, condition that needs to be present in order for you to actually take trade okay this is the range trading what do I mean by range trading okay price needs to be bouncing off of two areas okay like up there that's the resistance so if you see the price go up to the resistance it says that sell at resistance okay so then you'd want to be selling when there's um, you're at the top of the range and then if the price comes down to the bottom of the range you want to be doing what you want to be buying okay you want to be selling at resistance and buying at support guys this is elementary stuff okay but then if you don't understand and you're new make sure that you reach out to me and then i'll just set you on your way all right i'll give you the tools that you need to get started but anyway uh for this particular strategy these are the two things that you need to know okay so say with me guys the first condition that you need to to to, to trade this strategy is there needs to be a trend line breakout. Number one, trend line breakout. Say it with me, guys. Trend line breakouts. Okay? There needs to be a trend line breakout if you're going to be using the strategy. If there's no trend line breakout, you don't, you probably don't have a trade. But if there's a trend line breakout, you have a trade. Okay? It's an opportunity for you to make money. And then number two, there needs to be a trading range. What do I mean by trading range? Price needs to be trading in between a support and a resistance. Okay? It needs to be bouncing off of that. So, for instance, now if you get a, a buy entry at the bottom here at the support, you know that you're going to have to buy. If you get a sell entry at the top, you know you're going to have to sell. Okay? 
a very simple stuff. So I think there's another example. Here's another example of the range, guys. Forget what's written there. All right, you've got price bouncing off of this bottom here, going up to the top there, coming back down to the bottom there, right? And that that would indicate to you that you probably should be uh, buying at that area. Okay, then it comes back to the top, doesn't break the top, comes back down. Okay, this is elementary stuff, guys. Okay, don't don't think about it too much. Okay, you just need two different trading conditions: trend line breakout and a range. Price needs to be in a range. This is very simple. Okay, if you don't understand that. Okay, make sure that you slow this video down and watch it again. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding, guys. If you if you don't understand what's the difference between a range and a trend line breakout, send me a message. Send me a um an email. My the the link is in the description or the email address is in the description, and then just reach out to me and then we can just start talking from there. Okay. Rather get the knowledge than blow accounts. Okay. Some of you want to blow accounts instead of getting the knowledge. I don't know what's wrong with you, but <laughs> that's what you do. I know a lot of you do that. But anyways, um, I'm here to help you guys. I'm here to uh, set you straight. So let's just dive in to uh, MetaTrader 4. Okay, so now this strategy is uh, one that it, it caught my eye. Like when I first saw it, then I had to purchase this system and you know load it up on my uh, MetaTrader 4 and test it and it's just very very powerful you know especially if you've got something that moves like a monster like it moves like the US 30 okay um, works very well on a five minute chart so I'm gonna show you guys how to get proper trades with this strategy okay and then if you're interested in the strategy by the end of the video make sure that you like this uh the, the this session and then leave a comment okay and then there's a link in the description that's going to take you to the page where you can just get this for yourself okay don't wait for nobody uh it's a very easy and powerful system so let's dive into it okay so you want to be trading on the five minute chart okay the five minute chart okay so now remember i told you guys there needs to either be two uh different conditions in order for you guys to to trade all right or to get a trade okay and then this 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 strategy is basically going to be showing you um uh when to buy when to sell it basically gives you a take profit and stop loss it will pop up it will probably pop up while i'm busy talking now, okay but it, it's it's not very vital right now uh just i'm going to be explaining this to you guys okay Anyways, so that you need to see either a trend line breakout or you need to see a range. Okay, very simple, guys. So this is going to be telling you. Okay, it's going to be telling you. Okay, the name of the strategy is Onyx Scalper. Okay, this is a scalping strategy. It works on M1, M5, M15. It doesn't work on the higher time frames. Okay, so this is for you guys who love like your heart to beat like you know this is this is for you this is for you if you want to make quick money a consistent money this is what you need to do okay remember i'm going to say this again guys because some of you don't get this okay you need to either see a trend line breakout or the price needs to be in a range in order for you to trade <laughs> okay all right so anyways let's get started so what are you going to do as soon as you hop up onto a chart okay what i like to do is go to the h1 chart Okay, let's just wait for it to load a little bit. Sometimes it, it takes a bit of time, you know, just to refresh. Look at that. It's doing that wheel. Why are you doing the wheel? Guys, I think technology is against you today. You know, it, doesn't, it knows that I'm going to be showing you guys some fire. All right, but anyways, we're just going to wait for the technology to get set straight. While it's loading, it's taking forever. But anyways, okay, now there's the... I was about to go on the ranks, but anyway, uh, the first thing that you're gonna do is, like I always tell you guys, you need to um, know where you're trading. So you're gonna be, uh, you're gonna do your trend lines first. This is like basic, guys. You have to do this, okay? If you don't do this, then uh, you're in trouble, okay? You need to understand this, All right? If you don't understand trend lines, uh, hit me up on email, and then uh, we'll just work from there, okay? Once you've got your trend lines on on the US 30, you go back to the five minute. Oh Lord, okay. I thought it was gonna take long to load, but anyways, we're back. Okay, you go to the five minute. Okay, so it's not always necessary for you to start on the H1. You can just pop up on this and then start trading. Okay, but in this case, you are gonna um, uh, do the the trend lines on the five minute as well. You started on the H1. Now you're gonna do it on five minute. Okay, and then I'm just gonna change this to a different color. Then we'll make that yellow. Okay, just to make it easy for you guys to see. 
Okay, so you're going to draw another trend line, guys. Okay, and remember what I said. We need to either see a range, okay, or we need to see a trend line breakout in order for us to take the trade. Okay, so this is very easy, right? This is no magic. No magic. You just draw trend lines. Uh, you look at what the Onyx scalp was telling you. It's telling you, okay, the last signal that you got was a buy, which was a buy entry right there. You know, there's, there's, you, you, you buy when there's this little dot there. Okay, you sell when there's that dot there on the yellow band. But anyway, the instructions are there if you are into this kind of trading. Okay, so I would probably also be trading at the bottom there because it was at the bottom of the range. But in this particular case, we just hopped up onto this chart right now. Okay, so what's gonna make us buy? Okay. So since this is already telling us that this is a buying opportunity, okay, um, usually what would happen, it would tell you, it will give you a signal, okay, and you probably would have um, entered this a long ago because I see that there was a trend line break if you, like, draw it with your eyes there, okay. There's a trend line break there, so that validated this buy. But anyway, since we just approached the market, I just want to show you guys how to do it, okay. So in this particular case, you've got the price now uh, playing towards this uh, trend line here. Okay, so then now if you see the price break out of the trend line, that's a potential trade. Okay, that's a potential trade. So you can either use what the Onyx scalper is telling you, right? There's um, a stop loss and a, a take profit that it gave. Okay, it just pops up, you know, like right now, they, I, I don't see it, but um, when, when there's a new opportunity, it will pop up again. Okay, and then now you're going to take the trade. Okay, so when the price breaks out of there, you're gonna take the trade, and where are your targets gonna be? Your targets are gonna be up there. You see that? And then your stop loss is either gonna be below the previous structure or below the range. Okay, makes sense, makes sense, makes sense, makes sense, makes sense. I hope it makes sense. Okay, because that like there's no other easy way to say it. Okay, if you're like a complete beginner, you know you need to get into the elementary class of trading. Okay, baby pips, download baby pips, okay. <laughs> Anyways, so yeah. That's how you find the trades. Okay, so then I would actually be trading this uh, when the price breaks up. Okay, and then I'd actually be buying, right? And then I'd also use like positive stop loss methods in order to um, secure my profits. But we've talked about that. It's there's a video in my in my in my channel where I spoke about how to use a stop loss the smart way. So if you're brand new, make sure that you go to that video and watch it. Okay. So anyway, what was I saying, guys? Because I want you guys to understand. Oh my word! Why are you okay? Did you see, guys? Like, I think there's some witchcraft fighting us because we're talking about fire, 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 fire. But anyways, yeah. So this is the Onyx scalpel, guys. Another thing, what it does, like, um, okay, these indicators don't repaint from this company. So okay. So now, when it's got a blue band like that, okay, you sh you should be buying, okay. And when it's got a red band like that. It should be you should be selling, okay. So now let's say there's a blue band over there, uh, and there's this um dot over here. This is an optimal entry, okay. So then now it tells you that okay, now is a good time for you to buy. So when this shows up, you know you're supposed to make some money, okay. But then now there has to be confluence, guys, okay. Um, I don't really trust every single signal that I get there, I want to confirm it. <laughs> with my trading conditions, okay. So let's just say, for instance, for um, interest sake, let's say now the price turns here, all right, and there's an optimal sell entry, okay. It would make sense to sell because you're rejecting a trend line, okay, and you are at the top of the range. Remember what happens at the top of the range? You sell at the top of the range, okay. You just need to understand that, and then if you understand that, it's gonna be very, very easy for you okay but anyway guys um that's the strategy that's how you trade on a five minute chart so let's just go over it again okay what do you need to see in order for you to trade there either needs to be a range okay there needs to be a range price needs to be um pre trading between two obvious points or like two obvious zones all right like in this picture here the price was trading between these two zones okay and then now uh, if you're using the Onyx scalp and it tells you to buy when you're close to the bottom here, that's that, that's a valid entry, okay? It'll tell you where to take profit and to stop loss. Very, very valid entry, okay? So, like another example as well. So, here's the other one that we spoke about, the other trading condition. Let's say now uh, you have your trend line and there's a breakout, okay? And then the Onyx scalp is also telling you to sell, 
okay that's a valid signal guys you fail okay like it's so simple i know like maybe for some of you who are brand new it might be a bit difficult for you to understand this but it's very easy okay it's very very easy all right so anyways let's recap you need two either two trading conditions you either need to see uh, a breakout or you need to see price trading in between two zones two levels it needs to be in the range okay and then there needs to be a buy entry signal or sell entry signal from the onyx scalper strategy okay and then that's going to validate uh your entries it's going to validate your 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 yourself so i mean your buys and sells so then let's just say for instance you have a buying opportunity at a support and onyx scalper is telling you to buy you better buy on the five minute chart okay so that's typically how you want to be trading on the us 30 on a five minute chart okay thumbs up thumbs up thumbs up thumbs up thumbs up okay so anyway guys this is the end of the session okay if you want to know more about this make sure that you hit a like 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 this session first like this session before you do anything like uh if you've got questions leave a comment and then now uh, if you want more about you want to know more about the strategy just make sure you send me an email the email is in the description and if you just don't want to waste time you just want to start making money with me during this, this series okay um, make sure that you hit the link uh, the, the, the onyx scalper link is going to take you to the website where you can actually purchase it and download it and start making money okay <laughs> but anyway you just follow these rules these simple rules that i'm showing you guys and then it's going to be very very easy for you guys to trade okay so anyway practice makes perfect and yeah that's the end for me guys so thank you so much for watching and leave a like leave a like and a comment and subscribe to the page and i will be seeing you in day two all right that's the end for me